Happy Wednesday, friends. Today you are going to be writing a haiku. I know when I learned about haikus, I kind of had a hard time with the syllables component of the haikus, making sure that everything was only five syllables and then only seven and then going back to five. And it's such a short poem. There really is an author's craft to writing haikus. So I'm here making a quick little video on what helped me write a haiku in not a lot of time. <clears throat> What I did is I took a piece of paper out and I wrote down either trips I had taken or really wanted to take. So maybe you went somewhere really fun a couple of years ago for summer vacation, or maybe you're going somewhere for summer vacation this year. Maybe you guys went on a fun family staycation um, or vacation, you know, like somewhere camping already this year, or you took a trip to see one of your favorite places, like maybe a waterfall or mountains or anything. <clears throat> Think of a place that you have been or are going to go, want to go, write them down on a piece of paper. Then what you are going to do is you are going to look up animals, landmarks, um, things like that on Google. And so I picked Yellowstone. So when I typed in Yellowstone, I put landmarks in Yellowstone and it came up with certain words. And then I put in animals in Yellowstone <clears throat> and it came up with animals. And there was like things to do in Yellowstone and it came up with activities that you could do in Yellowstone. And what I did was I said those words out loud in my head and I picked words that had one to three syllables in them and I put them together. For the first line, I made sure that my words only had five syllables, my second line that I had seven syllables, and my third line that I had five again. So Google can really be your friend and this is not meant to stump you or trick you or anything like that. It does require a little bit of extra thinking and some craft and really deciding what's gonna go into your poem since it's so limited. Do your best not to repeat any words um, because that's kind of a waste of wording with a haiku since it's so limited as it is. Super excited. If you have any questions, please ask me or your teacher and we would be happy to get you started on your haiku poem.